Atlanta or also known as Rogers Road and heard the story of just the spring of life of water there and the friendships that found their beginnings there as well. And I have kept in touch with all of those people from the picture that I have from my Papa Bear over there of us. And it is this kind of strange community that you walk around and they'll lose each other for a few weeks and then out of nowhere you'll hear a voice and sometimes you remember the strangest things like a voice and I think we, Marie and I ran into each other and she heard my voice and so <laughs> it was like I had known her all my life <laughs> when in actuality I would only known her for kind of that one night and maybe hiking a few days and staying in the same shelter. But the bond that was formed was amazing. But part of that I think is also a testament to who she is because she has just the light of life in her heart and she shares that with everyone she meets. And you certainly will have been touched by that as you've met her maybe for the first time or known her for a long time. But then when we saw each other again in the Smokies, and this uh, ruffian behind her <laughs> came, came up, and, uh, and, and he, would, he introduced himself to me. He says, well, you can call me Jason or Floyd. <laughs> so I, I was never quite sure which was his trail name <laughs> until we became friends uh, later. But uh, we hiked through the, uh, the Smokies, part of the Smokies, and it rained a lot. So we had to stop at shelters and kind of hang out a little bit more. And that same kind of light and love that you get from Maria, you get it in a little more quirky way than from Jason. <laughs> he's just someone that you just feel so at ease with. And, and so all of you know that if you've been him for long. And, and then when I kind of left you guys, I had to go to a family wedding. I thought, something is going on here with these two. <laughs> until May, but, but and I was right, something was going on, <laughs> <laughs> but we didn't know. <laughs> so, so it's just great to be here, I feel so honored to be a part of this and getting to know the people who love you and care for you and have made you who you are, and they have done a darn good job, and I feel to commend your parents and your family and, and all of us that love you and just wish you the very best and many happy trails. You're the highlight of the trail. And you could certainly tell walking along and reading when you stop at a shelter that you have the journals that you write in to kind of keep up with people. And there was always something about groceries and Floyd or somebody you could always count on somebody looking for them or they were writing something encouraging you to go on. And that's just the kind of people they are. And I can just I can't wait to see your kids and all that stuff. <laughs> 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 I think that's just going to be a whole lot of fun. <laughs> Maybe a dog, you know? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe a cat. <laughs> 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 but whatever. But, um, anyway, love you guys and just wish you the best. And thank you for 